friendly as shark title is often associated with the nurse shark. Nurse sharks, known for being at the bottom of the ocean, usually won't bother you. Nurse sharks are considered non-threatening. They're considered totally harmless. Nurse sharks pose little threat to humans. Nurse sharks are usually pretty docile and gentle. Docile and gentle. Now, one of these sharks grabbed onto her. <laughs> I do have to warn you, we're showing you parts of the video that can be a little bit graphic. And the whole thing caught on video. <laughs> What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Shark Bites. I hope you enjoyed that intro as much as I did. <laughs> yeah, that's right. It's time for that influencers getting rinsed by Nurse Sharks video that I promised you a little while back. There was a bunch of you that wanted to see this video and to be honest, there was a fair whack of clips online for me to choose from. <laughs> you won't believe the amount of nonsense that I had to sift through though to make this video for you. <laughs> there seems to have been a trend amongst YouTube vloggers in the last six months or so where they all seem to be claiming that they've been attacked by a shark. I mean, look at some of this shit. Of course, none of these videos had any real shark bite in them, but thankfully for you guys at home, I've managed to find lots. <laughs> Some of the videos we've already featured here on Shark Bites, but there's definitely a few new ones coming up today. So, nurse sharks are often described as the puppies of the sea due to their pretty relaxed and docile nature. I say pretty relaxed there because every now and again these sharks can pack a real punch if they want to. Nurse sharks are a species that I'm really fond of and I've worked with them quite a lot down the years. Saying that actually, if you wanted to watch the research video that we did right here on Shark Bites where in my research paper I was showing that they can walk, yes, walk along the sea floor, then give that link a click. Anyway, so I know nurse sharks quite well, and I know that they're not a species to be messed around with. But unfortunately, it seems like there's a lot of people that don't seem to realize they're not a species to be messed around with. I'm not sure how there are so many clips online of people getting absolutely destroyed by nurse sharks. I've swum with them on so many different occasions, adults and juveniles, and I have never once had the inkling of one being aggressive towards. Me. And that's because if you follow a few basic rules, you're generally going to be very safe around these animals, but more on that later. I'd like to stress briefly before we start though, all of the people that feature in today's video, even though they were bitten, live to tell the tale. And that's because even though these sharks can be little biters, their teeth are very, very small. So while they might have needed a few stitches here or there, everyone turned out fine. Right. Let's jump in. So up first, we've probably got the most famous of all influencer nurse shark bites. This is Katarina Zorotsky, and you'll have likely seen her face or at least this picture splashed all over social media down the years. Although, sadly, we haven't got a video of this one to show you. Katarina was, of course, going for the classic influencer picture here where she wanted to be lying on her back, surrounded by nurse sharks, but... One of the nurse sharks had other ideas and latched down onto her arm, dragging her underneath the water. As nurse sharks tend to do, it did let go pretty quickly, but Katarina says she was being dragged under the water for nearly 10 seconds. I'm not quite sure I believe that one, Katarina. <laughs> it did leave her with a nice few bite marks on that arm and she had to have a few stitches to sort it out. Katarina though, the aspiring model that she was, decided she was gonna capitalize on this event as Instagram influencers and models regularly do and ended up featuring on every damn news show in North America talking about the few seconds where a nurse shark nipped her and let her go. Talk about five minutes of fame. <laughs> a couple of things she probably could have done to not get bitten might have been to not stick your fleshy hands and arms out lying on your back while surrounded by nurse sharks. That'd be a start. Okay, next up here, this one is from the Bahamas and we've got this guy here stood in waist high water holding a nurse shark in his arms. Turns out one of the nurse sharks below the water doesn't quite like the fact he's holding one of his bros and supposedly decides to have a chomp on this guy's leg. Now, I'm not sure if there was an actual bite here because we can't see under the water. I'd say it's also entirely possible that a nurse shark just brushed the wrong way up this guy's leg because that's enough to feel like a bite and also cut you as well. What I do like here though is what one of the tour operator guys says. Oh, no, he won't bit you. <laughs> I love that. Nah, he won't bit you. What on earth this tour operator is doing though, letting people hug these sharks? It's actually baffling. Like, I've seen lots of things like this before where people sort of wade into the water and the sharks swim around them, but I've not seen many where people are actively holding and hugging the sharks. So whatever nonsense is happening here, definitely needs to stop. 
Right, next, we've got another model here who's desperate for some Nurse Shark content. I think I remember featuring this one before, and it's a little annoying because we don't get the full video. What we do see, though, is the girl dive down right into the swim path of three oncoming Nurse Shark. It's a wonder she doesn't smack into the first one, but then she also manages to get in the way of this one here, which decides to chomp down on her shoulder. The Nurse Shark here is just clearly not happy that this girl has got right up in its personal space and has given her a nice back the f up bite. We can see the damage to her shoulder and back there. Those serrated teeth show no mercy. If you're ever free diving down though, guys, make sure you just check what's happening in your surroundings. I don't know, it's kind of like crossing the road. <laughs> so this next one isn't technically an influencer one, I suppose, but it definitely still falls under the category of a shit show. <laughs> this, I presume, mother is holding not one, not two, not three, but four children in her arms. How or why she thought this was a good idea, I will never know. As a certified dive master, I'm only allowed to supervise two open water students at one time, and this girl's got four toddlers. Anyway, one of the little terrors decides she's gonna stick her hand out and pet the juvenile nurse shark on the head, and those tiny little fingers are looking well and truly like a fishy snack for that nurse shark, so it decides to have a little pop. This is a one-way track to losing those little cocktail sausages, Missy. Don't stick your fingers near the nurse sharks. I feel like that should be on every signpost near these stupid tourist interactions. I love this little bro on the left-hand side here, though, just screeching his head off. He knows what's up. Okay, next. I don't think we've featured this one before, but we've got some more shithousery of people trying to feed nurse sharks, this time from the boat, and this time it's a tawny nurse shark. If we freeze frame it here, the shark has its head a good three feet out of the water because it's decided to just not let go after biting down. Down. What a chomper. I mean, I'm not surprised though. These guys have some of the most powerful suction force bites in the shark world. So you do not want your hands anywhere near their mouths. Stop feeding sharks. <laughs> Is that another one we can add to the, to the stop touching shark slogan we got? Who wants that on some merch? Let me know in the comments. Look how unimpressed this news reporter is though. That is a face of pure disappointment when he's had to read this out. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of trying to feed sharks, next up we've got TikTok Beer Bro here stood in the water with some sort of food item in his hands trying to hand feed nurse sharks. But the issue here is when these sharks have been provisioned with food before, they're going to start getting a little bit angsty around people who have food. It's like gulls here in the UK and I guess in America too. They've been fed chips before, so now they try and swoop down and eat other people's chips. The same applies here with the nurse sharks. As soon as they think they're going to get fed, they're all razzed up. And this particular shark has a little nip at this guy's arm before proceeding to swim off pretty quickly. I think he's got pretty lucky with that one because I think it could have properly chomped down on his arm. <laughs> what do you reckon? I whipped this one up in about three minutes. Would you buy it? I can't use that one though because I'm pretty sure I've used a lot of copyrighted vectors creating that image. So I expect I'll be sued immediately. <laughs> You get the idea though. Let me know if you want something like that to be on the Shark Bites merch store. Okay, next. This one here is a model supposedly going cage diving with... Oh, wait, shit. Those are lemon sharks. <laughs> I'm not quite sure how this one slipped into my Nurse Shark compilation, but we're going to roll with it. So suddenly she pulls her foot up and the next minute we see her in the boat with a big old wound on her foot. As if any of us are supposed to believe that. Like a lemon shark is just going to stick its head through the cage and bite down on her foot. Also, the type of wound there isn't anything like what a shark bite would be. Those are usually arched or somewhat serrated, but that one's just a straight gashed line. So yeah, this is definitely faked and is clearly a promo for their very adults only website of which I'm not going to name because I refuse to give them any more promotion in a fake shark attack video. And also I think I'd probably get demonetized. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on swiftly from that one. Yep, back again with another influencer doing the classic lying on the back pose. This time it's a TikTok influencer, you know, because we like to shake it up a bit every now and again. Of course, she's got her eyes closed and those nice fleshy limbs stretched out to her side. So it's definitely dinner time for this nurse shark who clamps down nice and hard on her hand and wrist. Who in their right mind thinks it's a good idea to go swimming with sharks with your eyes closed. Ah, oh, yeah, this is cool. I guess I'm just gonna go and stick my hand into some water that's got sharks in it. Ugh, this is painful. We get to see this gnarly bite here though, which has shredded up her hand good and proper. Look at her face though. I honestly think that's a face that wasn't expecting to get bitten on the hand by a nurse shark. You know, even though she closed her eyes and stuck her hands into the water with nurse sharks. <sighs> okay, next. Now, I think I have seen this one before, but I can't remember if we featured it here on Shark Bites. There's been so many guys, give me a break. So this guy thinks it's a good idea to kiss the nurse shark on the mouth. He's decided to kiss the strongest vacuum cleaner you've ever seen that's filled inside with hundreds of serrated needles. 
Sounds like a good idea, right? What could possibly go wrong? Oh yeah, he gets bitten right on the face. That's what could possibly go wrong. Have a guess how many stitches this dude needed after necking on with that nurse shark. 50, 100, nah. 285 stitches. How do you even fit that many stitches on your lips? Don't kiss sharks. Is that another t-shirt? Nah, nah, it's getting silly now. <laughs> okay, we've got another influencer here having her five minutes with a nurse shark when it spots that nice flesh-colored hand floating around in the water and chomps down on the tasty snack. This girl literally puts her hand towards the shark. Like, come on now, what did you honestly think was going to happen when you did that? <laughs> <laughs> I swear too many people have read that these sharks are sea puppies as opposed to serrated vacuum cleaners of death. She literally reaches out to stroke it on the head like it's a Labrador. <laughs> Girl, when a shark is coming at you like that, do not think it's coming over for cuddles. It is not coming over for cuddles. She also ends up with some pretty impressive slash wounds on her hand and wrist though, which you can see here. Do I say it again? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna say it again. Don't stick your hands towards the pointy end of the shark. <laughs> yes, I love this one. We've definitely had it before on the channel, and I think before I've referred to it as the penis biting nurse shark. He didn't get your penis, did he? No. Okay, okay, it's not really got him on the penis, it's the lower stomach, but it looks like it was headed that way. This is of course Florida Man, who apparently was out diving and fishing for lobsters. I think he's probably had a lobster on him, and this nurse shark has decided that it wants the lobster. They really do like lobsters. But in the process, instead of latching down on the lobster, this shark has latched down on this bloke's portly bread belly. I think less of a tasty snack, all things considered. But juvenile nurse sharks, when they bite down, often don't tend to let go. It's because the juveniles have smaller mouths than the adults, which means it's harder for them to stop that suction than if they had a larger mouth like the adults do. Also, then when they're removed from the water, the gill slits can collapse, and that makes the suction even stronger. Poor little guys couldn't even let go if they wanted to. Up next then, we've got a male Instagram influencer this time. Yep, there are a few of those around, would you believe it? We have featured this one before on the channel, but again, it's the classic slow motion dive down there and he's just not looking at all where the nurse sharks are. His arm is outstretched perfectly right in front of that nurse shark's face. No wonder he gets a bite here. I honestly don't know why these Instagram influencers don't dive down looking where they're going because you can easily dive down and see where the sharks are and then swim up from underneath. It's just really, really important to make sure you know where the sharks are at all times. As soon as you take your eyes off that animal, you increase the chance of getting bitten massively. His bite marks here are also pretty gruesome. You can see the pinpoint teeth marks here on his palm, and then on the back of the hand here, you can see where he's tried to pull that hand out of the shark's mouth and just sliced it on those teeth. Real grim. So, what are my top tips to stop influencers and people getting bitten by nurse sharks? Well, they're pretty simple, really. Step one, don't actively go to touch the nurse shark. As soon as you move closely towards that animal, you are running the risk of agitating it and causing it to lash out. Step two, don't feed the nurse shark. Feeding them not only conditions them to associate humans with food, you also run the risk of losing your hand into the serrated vacuum of death. And step three, keep your eyes on the shark. Always look where you're swimming and make sure your hands and feet aren't dangling right in front of them. Three simple steps there. So if there's any influencers out there watching this video, you stay safe, guys. Even though I've made a bunch of jokes today about these particular sharks, they are still one of the best sharks to swim with. All you have to do is use a bit of common sense when you're swimming with them. I'd say it's not that hard, but then Look at all the videos we've seen today. <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, please do give it a like, by the way. And if you've seen any other crazy influencer shark bites, then please do send them my way. We're also very nearly at 50,000 subscribers, by the way, guys, which I just can't believe. So let's all push together and make sure we get towards that 50,000. Like and comment on all the videos, share them with anyone you think that might enjoy them because at 50K, we're gonna do another Shark Bites giveaway. And that giveaway we're doing is gonna be the biggest one we've done yet. So make sure you're around for that one. You're not gonna to wanna to miss out. But before you head off, if you like Nurse Sharks, despite what we've seen today, you're gonna to wanna to click on this video right here where you can watch me talking about some research I did on them a few months ago. No spoilers, but in this video right here, you're gonna see a Nurse Shark using its pectoral fins to walk on the seafloor. It's absolutely crazy, so click it.